What's good YouTube? This your boy Chi World back at y'all again with another art video. And today we finna make a cartoon head out of that boy Playboy Cardi. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe. Make sure you hit post notification so you will be notified every time I drop some heat. In today's video, we're gonna focus on the sparkle in the chain and we're gonna focus on shading. I'm gonna give y'all some tips and tricks on how to shade if you're not that good at it. And let's go ahead and jump into this video. Now we finna get into shading. Now a method you can use if you you ain't that good at shading. What you wanna do is you wanna bring, you wanna mute your color layer. You wanna bring back your picture layer. We're gonna make it back. We're gonna bring the opacity back up. Okay. We're going to create a new layer for shading. What you want to do is all the, the darkest spots, we're going to kind of trace, but we're going to add a little flare to it. We're going to, so let me go and click my color and make this color a little darker. And this is gonna be the darkest part of the shade. So we're gonna mute that again. And now we're gonna trace it, but we're gonna add our own. We're gonna add our own spin to it. Okay, we got our first layer out of the way. As far as the shading of the skin, now we just gonna go, gonna lock that layer, and create a new layer, and we're gonna put it under the darkest shadow, and we're gonna go a little darker, or right in between, we're gonna find an in between color. I think, that's about it right there. We're gonna do the same process.
Now we finna add some detail to the chain. First thing we're gonna start out with is the shadow. Time to add the sparkle effect inside the chain. So what you wanna do, man? Drop your opacity on your brush and just come make these little Under the line work. And a little shortcut you can do. Come over here and do it. Say like this. Bring the opacity up. Okay, that's good. Copy it. Control C. Then you can come over here and paste it with Control V. Just hold, keep holding out and dragging it where you want it to be. Got the chain glistening. I'm gonna add a layer on top of your line work. We're gonna go to this little star tool and you post off. While you got it hold, while you holding it, you gotta press the down arrow on your keyboard. Then I think you hold. Uh, you still got it. Are you still holding it? You gotta hold control and stretch it out to make a little diamond effect. Okay, drag it to the side. And what we're gonna do is so we're gonna Make a circle. Put 
put it in the middle. And you're gonna make it small. One small circle like that. Then you're gonna come back and make another circle. put it on in the center and we're gonna go to effects and you're gonna go to blur preview we're gonna make this thing I'm gonna make this thing shine so I don't pass it down so wait no bring the opacity back up probably yeah, 92. I'm gonna try to make your circle smaller. I think that'll do. Then while we got everything selected together, we're gonna expand appearance. We're gonna click merge on your pathfinder so we can make make it one. Just gonna select everything and hold it out and make copies of it. If you want to shrink it to a smaller size, you hold shift and alt together. And you just pull the edge down. And now you can place these around randomly.